Three years ago, we set out to make an asphalt recycler that could produce a high quality mix every time. This is a two ton unit. This is the Renova 4000, which is the number of pounds it handles. So what our design strategy was, is to have a high quality output of the mix. The three things out that we want, elasticity, adhesion, and compression. The three things that go into it to get to those three things out are the three components of any hot plant. So it's heat, it's mixing, and your oil, your additive. We have a direct flame, and then we have cascading mix on the side. In terms of the, the mixing, we designed flighting that accomplished that and a rotation of anywhere from one to nine RPM of the drum to keep the mixing going on, especially important after we add the rejuvenator. These bricks add asphalt cement, and they add a little bit of rubber, and they also have two softeners in there. The combination of having a radiative direct fire, no contact heat, uh, true turbulence with proper flighting mixing, and the right rejuvenator gives us a high quality mix every time. And you should be able to produce it for about $20 a ton, rather than whatever you're paying for at the plant. 59? 69. And then of course winter, that goes up when you're talking about cold patch, right? So we're still down at $20 and, and you don't have to drive to the plant either. So we can put chunks in, put millings in. The design is for to recycle asphalt, right? One of the things that it does that's very important is the, the ability to reheat. So once you make your load, you can take it from site to site. You can heat it up as many times as you want, as long as you're keeping it under that threshold of 340 degrees. One way to use it is to park it next to your pile of millings and fill the hot boxes. Another is to take it to the site and drop it right in the hole or right in the wheelbarrow or shovel it out. The first batch is going to take us 30 minutes, second batch 20, third batch 15. Uh, we have a 26 horse Kohler engine. One end of the shaft drives our hydraulics. The other end of the shaft is a 5.5 kilowatt generator that provides electricity for the controls and the four fans. What we have found is properly mixed, we can produce a high quality repair every time.